coming off a big win last week against Concordia here at uh, home. Uh, it was the type of game that I was uh, expecting, a very close, uh, close tight game. Uh, they were a really good football team, uh, and we saw that in film, so we knew it was going to be a tight game. Uh, we thought we, we could score a little bit more against them, and we did have a touchdown call back uh, on a holding call, but uh, all in all, you know, I think uh, the first half uh, was played to a scoreless tie. Both defenses were very, very good. Second half, we were able to put up a touchdown and a field goal, and and they got their uh, their field goal uh, early in the fourth quarter, late in the third quarter, I guess it was. So, but uh, our defense was phenomenal, played great the whole game, um, and uh, took away their their uh, big rushing game. And uh, our offense uh, sputtered at times, but we did move the football when we needed to. And you know, again, uh, would have liked to have scored more. But uh, all in all, the big thing was we came out with a win, and and uh, that gave us an opportunity to continue playing. On uh, Sunday, we were announced as one of the 32 teams to the playoffs. Unfortunately, we don't have a home game. We're going to be going to North Central, uh, but uh, uh, we're in the playoffs. We're one of 32 teams, and we think we have a realistic chance of uh, keeping this going. So North Central is a very good football team, much like us, very quick, very athletic, very fast. Uh, it's going to be a great game. We're going to have to be at the very top of our game to beat them, but uh, that's our plan going forward. And uh, we hope that we can get a few people down to North Central Naperville, Illinois, and uh, watch us uh, against a very good North Central team.